Hola, muy buenas tardes, o buenos días, o buenas noches. Sí. Um, welcome to audio and video number 12 in our vocab building uh, sessions for Victor's Adventures in Spain, the book. The, um, it's a parallel textbook. Ok, bien. Estamos en la M. We're starting with M now. So, first word that we're going to learn today is maleta, okay, which is suitcase. Maleta, maleta. Now, I bet you know what I'm going to say now, listening to that word, maleta. Okay, so imagine you've got your suitcase and you open it up and you put You look at and this is my letter and you put a big letter in the suitcase and somebody says what have you got in your suitcase I've got maleta in the suitcase okay maleta next one mañana mañana now if you don't know this word then where have you been okay well, maybe You don't know it um, but most people know mañana it means tomorrow okay mañana is tomorrow and um, how would you remember mañana well something simple like oh I'm going to see a man tomorrow and he's called Anna by the way a man called Anna mañana tomorrow but I'm only going to see him tomorrow not today tomorrow a man called Anna okay mañana I used to have a tell you story, I had a boss um, who worked with me in Mexico and he would say to me, Gordon, here everything is like mañana, mañana, mañana. And I used to think, well it's not mañana really, it's mañana, okay? Um, but anyway, and it wasn't, there were lovely people in Mexico. Um, they did it today, just a little bit later. Um, next one is way, the word way, and what I mean by way is um, he has a strange way about him, okay? It's the way of doing things, all right? Not like a, a way that you would walk through. So he has a way about him, he has a strange way of doing things, and that word is manera. Manera. So it's very easy, really, when you think about it, because we have the same word, we have manera. And if you think about the sentence, he has a strange way about him, we can say he has a strange manner about him. He has strange manners, he has a strange manner, okay? Um, so, it's the same word, it's just they use manera instead of way, okay? Way is in Mexico, that's a different word. Um, so, you can learn it this way, or in this manner. Manera, okay? This way or in this manner, manera. Next one, and this is a lovely word when somebody asks you how you are. Well, it's actually it's, uh, slightly different. It's wonderful, okay? Wonderful. And that's maravilla. Okay? And I'll tell you how you use it, okay? Somebody says to you, how are you today? You can say, estoy de maravilla. I am wonderful. Estoy de maravilla. Okay? Nice way of answering people. So, maravilla. So, think of the word marvelous, because that's really the, the root. Marvelous. Okay? And you could say, yeah, I've got a, a wonderfully marvelous villa. Maravilla. Okay? Estoy de maravilla. Let's see if you can use that at least two times this week when somebody asks you how you are. Obviously in Spanish, not in English. They wouldn't understand what you were talking about. Okay, next one is the word more. More, okay? And more is más. Más. So imagine a preacher in the church and he's looking at his congregation, his depleted congregation, and he says to them, we need more people in the mass. We need more people in the mass. 
more, más. Okay. Then we've got this one, which is m, the majority, majority. Okay. And to say majority, you say mayoría. Mayoría. Okay. Mayoría. So really, it's virtually the same as majority. It's just got an ear on the end. Okay. Mayoría. So think of uh, saying, oh, we've got the majority here. Majority here. Okay. You, we've got the minority. We've got the majority here. Mayoría. Okay. And then the last one is half. Half. For example, if you wanted to say half full. Okay, we already know what full is. Japan is full of yen, yeno. Okay, so if you wanted to say half, the word is medio. Medio. Okay, it's not medio. It's medio. So you say medio, yeno. Okay, and how do you remember half? Well, it's it sounds like medium, doesn't it? Which is the half halfway point between small and large. It's halfway, medio. Okay, so it's when you want to say something like half full, half empty, yeah, half drunk, medio borracho, okay. All right, so there we are. So we've got seven words. Let's check them out and see whether you've, how well you've remembered them, let's say that. First one is, Maleta. Maleta. So you're imagining where have I got my letter? In my suitcase. Suitcase is maleta. Okay. And what about mañana? Mañana. That's right. I'm going to see a man called Anna. Tomorrow. Tomorrow is mañana. Uh, what about this one? Manera. Manera. Is he has a strange manner about him or he has a strange way? So manera is way. Okay. Um, Frank Sinatra, you know, I did it my way. Well, in Spanish, the Spanish version is lo, lo hice a mi manera. A mi manera, it's my way, okay. Um, okay, and then, maravilla. Maravilla, what's that word? Wonderful, that's right. And how do you say it? Estoy de maravilla, I am wonderful. Okay, now, más. is the preacher saying we need more people in the mass so mass is more and then mayoría mayoría we have the majority here majority here mayoría and then the last one medio medio is medium in between it's the halfway point so half medio half full half empty okay yeah hemos terminado uh, tenemos más m's eh? we've got more m's so i will see you in the next one nos vemos hasta pronto adios